gas station and say hi. I caught up and see if I can figure out what's rubbing. But like I said, I'm going. I, I was going 50, so now I've slowed down to 45. Okay, so here it is. It's at her house. I won't say it was uneventful because, yeah, that thing. So what it was is what was coming loose was this right here, which goes underneath the bumper. And since it's all damaged, it's not hooked to nothing. So it would come loose. It would kick back and hit the tire. So what I did is we pulled over one. I took a piece of the metal wire off here and then tied it, you know, the fender wheel arch. To the front bumper tied it on after that had no issues so basically ah it's here which is a good thing now just need to get back home which is fine because that's where we're heading but her car is here oh yeah she has pink house really weird but her car is here. Now it's her project. She supposedly has the new panel for the front of this thing. So you can start really getting into it, tearing it apart and start doing all the mods to it. So I guess time to head home and we'll pick this video up tomorrow. Doing something, probably working on the Honda, like I said in the last video. So catch you tomorrow. Okay, it's a few days later. Well, really, it's just, I guess, next day, really. Say a few days. So, next day, got back from dropping her car off. Um, well, Amazon did really well. They got here in next day, basically. So, here's my Moroso bolts for my intake manifold. So, I got those in. So, we'll be doing these on the next video. So, here's what's funny. is I think I talked about this in a while, a while ago video. So, public notice, City of Hampton, where I live. Beginning July 1st, 2022, Hampton residents will no longer be able to park in their front lawns if parking is allowed on their street. Yeah, I'm in a lot of issues here. Because, basically, I read the whole thing. You can go to the website. You can check it all out. So, basically, like this... This is, you know, against their rules. We'll get to this in a minute. So, I have driveway. Must park my cars in the driveway or in the street. If they're in the yard, which, you know, I park my cars in the yard all the time. It's my yard. I pay for this. So, if they said if you have, like, a paved driveway, paver stones, gravel, or anything like that, that makes up your driveway or a parking system, it's legit and you're good. So... Yeah, I know. Truck's like in here. So what I did is I have stones. I have like, that's big, like 18 by 18, which I tore up because I was like just messing. Because, well, so I took up three and I got one, two, three more. There's one underneath. And then I got the other blocks in the backyard. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put these here. I need to get a shovel so I can dig those and plant them down. Then I also need to finish getting them for this side so I can go there and I'm gonna do that on both sides so I've got plenty of brick between these three 18 by 18 inch stones right there and I got one right there then I got all of those so needless to say I have plenty oh do some weed eating some weeding so i've got plenty of stone i'm not like stressed on that aspect of it okay we got plenty there that's good yeah so i had to kill the weeds along the back because the homeowners behind me didn't want to ever cut their freaking grass it's all right i cut it for them ah <sighs> well do a little bit of yard work Gotta keep my yard looking good. 
Um, I'm off coming up here in a few days. Yeah, I had to pull some of this too. So I'm off work in a few days, so I need to go. I just, I didn't have the time, but I'm having an issue with my concrete because did not know this, but you need to have blueprints for them to just to lay concrete. So needless to say, I have to hire a architect or a draftsman, same kind of thing, basically, um, talk about my YouTube channel, <laughs> so I need to hire one of those, so I'm going to try to get on that Friday, which is basically the day, well, this video comes out Saturday, so that Friday, before this video comes out, I'll hopefully be talking to a person that can draw me up a real quick blueprint so that way I can hire the concrete and guy and get him out here and do it because when I do the building that ain't no big deal because when you do the building it comes with blueprints all that kind of stuff so I can submit those to get my building permit not a big deal but I need to get one for my concrete ASAP because I need to get this done so I'll be doing that in a day or two when I'm off. Because like I say, I gotta get this concrete done. This is important, 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 important. Oh yeah, next thing, I was like sitting there, I was like, there was something else I wanted to do. Oh. Yeah, today's just a goof off of vloggy day. Yeah, so needless to say, the other day, <laughs> there's no more window. I have the screen that goes in here. I need to figure out how to get the glass out and put the screen in this thing. At least to make it look a little decent. I think you pull these out. Out running the four wheels. Ooh, motorcycle. Dirt bike. Yeah, everybody in the neighborhood, they run dirt bikes and four-wheelers up and down the street all the time. Alright, I'm going to pull this out. I think it's like you pull this strip out along the edge right here and it should come out. Let me try that. Okay, I got the screen in there. I mean, it is better than having nothing. Because, well, that's what it was. Nothing. So, hopefully, that'll do a little bit better. <sighs> but, besides that... This is all I really was just goofing off this video. Just kind of me goofing off. Um, and saying my city sucks. So, next video, we will be on the big blazer because I got parts for it. So, we'll be wrapping that up. And we might, might be digging holes to plant concrete blocks in my yard. So, that way, I'm not against the city policy. But, eventually, later on, you know... These aren't gonna always sit like this. Then again, they might. One of them's probably gonna go into the garage. So the Silverado might wind up back at the garage. The Blazer might stay there once it's running. Maybe put the Honda up there. I don't know. But I know this is going in the garage. So there's still gonna be a lot of finagling and moving around of all the cars because once the garage gets built, this one will definitely be in the garage and who knows what else? Have some thoughts in the works. Oh well, have to just stay tuned for that. Garage first, projects last. Or future projects. Gotta get the garage up. So we'll be addressing that hopefully in the next couple of videos. I can get a draftsman or something together to do my concrete blueprints for me. So stay tuned because, like I said, got to get this done. All right, well, hope you enjoyed this little vlog. Wasn't nothing major. Just wanted to goof off a little bit. So thanks for watching. Thanks for subscribing. Catch you in the next one.